Peace, family. Welcome back to another video with Credit Healing LLC. Now, today we want to do is we want to talk about something that we typically don't talk about. However, we do think that you should know about it because we get a lot of inquiries about it, questions, and we've also assisted a lot of people in connecting them with our lenders as well as, as you know, helping build and heal their credit so they can be able to be pre-qualified and qualified for um, this particular subject, and that is real estate. Now, the reason that we're making this video is because many people have asked a question in regards to purchasing a home. Now, if you have not purchased a home before, we do not necessarily recommend that you purchase your first home as a single family home. This is why. Because when you think about it, you're getting into a mortgage, whether it's a 15 year, 30 year, etc., and you have to pay it off. Um, now you can sell it at a later date. Hopefully you get more money than what you purchased it for. However, if you're looking to purchase real estate, we don't necessarily recommend that you do this. Now, if you have purchased real estate before and you're looking to purchase um, a single family home and you know the game and how it works, then yes, you can purchase a single family home. Now, when you go into real estate, you want to focus on income, right? So you want to focus on passive income, making money uh, from your real estate deals, from your, um, you know, the rent that's coming in every month. And then from there, you can go into purchasing your single family home or purchasing land and then building your home where however you want to build it, you build exactly what you want after you have purchased your multifamily units. Now, multifamily units are simply duplexes, triplexes, or quadplexes, and in some states they call fourplexes. And the reason that you want to do this first is because you want to focus on having income, right? So say for instance, if the rent that you're going to be charging from the property that you purchase is $1,200 per unit. So if you have a duplex and it's $1,200 per unit, then basically that's $1,200 plus $1,200, that's $2,400 that's coming in every month. Now that's, that's $2,400 is going to cover your mortgage that you're going to be paying for the particular property, but also it's going to be covering things such as your um, savings, you know, if you have a car note or car insurance, you can pay that using uh the rent that's actually coming in and then you can look at investing or saving up your money or doing whatever you want to do such as taking a vacation etc with the rest of the, of the money that's coming in every month so you can continue to rent where you are and then while you're renting you can also um, now what i'm talking about i'm talking about you specifically renting in a house that you're actually staying in and then you can rent out the other properties that you're purchasing and then from there you can go and you can purchase two or three multifamily units and then once you get enough income that's coming in every month then you can look at going and purchasing a single family home or you can look at building a home on land that you just have purchased and therefore you you know you're not gonna have anything to worry about in terms of bills because everything's gonna be covered all the expenses are gonna be covering uh, be covered every month and then from there you know you can look at doing other things but we want to make that known to you all because we get a lot of people who want to hurry and purchase a home but it's not always the best idea or the best suggestion that we would um, give you in regards to purchasing real estate you want to think about having income so you don't have you know say for example, if you lose your job right you still have income from the property that you just purchased so don't go out and hurry and, and get a, a 30 year, 15 years, a 30 year mortgage when it's not necessarily, it's not necessary right now. You can do it at a later date, but you want to be able to have a, a good uh, portfolio, a uh, real estate portfolio for yourself and your family. Therefore, you have all of your expenses covered. You're not going to have to worry about coming out of pocket every month to pay things that you would otherwise not have to pay for if you would have that additional st uh, stream of income coming in. All right, family, so if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us at credithealing at gmail.com. Or if you're ready to start healing your credit, go to www.credithealing.org. Peace.